Good afternoon, everyone. All right, I wanted to come in with uh, day six of the 30 Days of Transformation live series that I'm doing. Super excited to get to come in with you guys again. Today, I it's, it's going to be super quick, but I basically wanted to introduce you to an idea. It might be an idea that you're aware of, uh, but maybe it's one that you're not. And even if you're aware of it, I want you to take a moment because for me, this is a concept that I was introduced to um, over two years ago, but I can honestly say that it's only in the last few weeks that I have really truly understood it at a new level. And so this is the concept of 100% responsibility. And the person that first said this to me over two years ago was the amazing Lisa Kordoff. Um, some of you may know her. Uh, she is uh, has had huge business success and works as a transformational coach. And she was introduced to the concept by James Wedmore, who you also might be aware of. Uh, but it's not a radical idea, okay? It's literally just the idea that we are all 100% responsible for 100% of the things that are going on for us 100% of the time. And with that responsibility... And having 100% responsibility, it means that we can literally choose to change anything. We can choose to do anything differently. We can choose to think differently. We can choose to feel differently. We can choose to act differently. We can choose to plan differently. We literally have supreme and ultimate control over what is going on for us. And... I love this concept, but I kind of hate it at the same time. (laughs) I love that I've got control over everything and the way that I react to everything. But I also don't like that I have complete control over everything uh, and that I'm 100% responsible because ultimately it means that if things are not going the way that I want them to go, if there's a relationship that isn't what I want it to be, if there's a job situation or a business situation or a family situation that isn't what I want it to be, then I have none other than myself, just me, to fix that situation. Now, you might be thinking, but, you know, there's all these circumstances and there's all these things. And I'm not saying that you have control over the rest of the world and over circumstances, although I think we have more control over those things than maybe we realize or recognize or want to recognize. But what I mean by this is that we are 100% responsible for the way that we react to all of those circumstances. And to the story that we create around those circumstances and what those circumstances mean. We are ultimately meaning making machines and we are making meaning from every single thing that happens to us. So what I wanted to talk to you guys today about, hey Sally, is basically that idea of 100% responsibility. Are you 100% responsible 100% of the time? Because I sure as hell wasn't. I think I was zero responsible 0% of the time a few years ago. And slowly I've been on this journey of taking more responsibility, of leaning into the discomfort that is, holy shit, I have control of the way that I respond to things. I have control of the way that I do things, the way that I think things, the way that I act things. And so I wanted to bring that to you guys because so often we are blaming all the people and all the things and all the circumstances for what is going on for us. And we're spending so much of that time blaming other people for those circumstances that we aren't taking five seconds to look at our own responsibility in that circumstance. It is easy to outsource responsibility. 
it is easy to say, oh, when this situation is different, then I'll be different. Or when that person behaves differently, then I'll behave differently. That's that whole when I, then I thing. But the reality is it all comes down to us. It all comes down to you. For me, it all comes down to me and to the idea that I'm 100% responsible 100% of the time for everything that I do, think, feel, the way that I show up in the world. So I would absolutely love for you to share down below and let me know, is that a new concept for you? Or is that something that you've heard before? Is it something that you've been trying to embody and trying to integrate like I have now for quite some time, but often finding new levels of that and new levels of realization of just how responsive I am for my own life and therefore the infinite ability for me to change anything that I want to be different. All right, I'm going to leave that thought with you guys today. I'd love to hear your comments down below. Thanks for joining me for day six of the 30 days of transformation. Reach out if you would like to do some work around this whole idea of being 100% responsibility, responsible and reach out if you're sitting there thinking, what the hell are you talking about? I'm not 100% responsible because I would love to have a conversation with you about the fact that you ultimately are. All right, I'm going to leave it there. I'll see you guys again tomorrow, day seven. Thanks for being on the journey with me and I'll chat to you then. Bye.